Remove the four thumb screws from the pump head cover. Remove the cover. Press the start button. Notice that the roller will only rotate at a slow, safe speed. Grasp the inlet pump tube fitting and pull the fitting straight out of the pump head. Allow the pump tube to automatically walk its way out of the pump head. Grasp the outlet pump tube fitting and pull the fitting straight out of the pump head. Press the stop button. The roller assembly and pump head should be inspected and cleaned before installing a new pump tube. This is especially important if the pump tube ruptured and the TFD system was activated. Be sure to also wipe clean the sensor pin with the front side facing forward. Replace the roller assembly by sliding the assembly onto the motor shaft. Replace the small spacer washer onto the motor shaft. Apply power to the pump. Press the start button. Notice that the roller will only rotate at a slow, safe speed. Notice that the pump tube is curved. Locate the inlet fitting. If the roller rotation is counterclockwise, this will be the bottom fitting. If the roller rotation is clockwise, this will be the top fitting. Press the inlet fitting into the slot in the pump head. Be sure the U-shaped fitting seats completely into the rear of the slot. Allow the pump tube to walk its way into the pump head. An installation tool is included with the A3 pump. Install the tool on the pump tube adapter on the outlet side. Gently pull on the outlet fitting until the fitting aligns with the outlet slot. Press the fitting into the pump head. Remove the installation tool. Replace the pump head cover. Be sure that the four thumb screws are fully installed. The A3 will detect the pump head cover and prompt the user to reset the pump tube timer to zero.